Hi, this is Michael, and this is a review of the Tautronics Thorlite model TT-TF01. This is a really nice flashlight. It's very solid. Uh, construction is, I think, very decent quality. Um, it's aircraft aluminum alloy T6061. Uh, it uses a Cree XML T6 LED, which is a very white light, and it's exceedingly bright has a stainless steel strike bezel and if you prefer you can use a non crenellated uh, just a black bezel you do get a replacement rubber cover for the push button and you also get a couple of extra o-rings to ensure the waterproofness of this so if you don't want the crenellated uh, bezel you can screw this black one on and that makes it a little more comfortable to carry in your pocket I suppose. Uh, I do like the crenellated bezel though because when you have that on and your flashlight is put down with the head down on a table standing straight up uh, you, you may not uh, see that light if you don't have the holes there in the crenellated be and the bezel there so that's a little bit handy. The lanyard that's included just attaches to the tail cap there and then there's also a clip, a pocket clip, and that just snaps on or off. The flashlight is capable of using a single AA, two AA's, or a single 14500 battery. And I'll just take it apart here so you can see everything. It's machined really well. And the tailpiece unscrews. So with just a single AA battery in there, I'll screw the cap back on here, um, one single AA is going to give you about an hour's worth of light at the highest setting, 168 lumens. Medium setting will give you about 46 lumens in about 4 hours, and the low setting will be about 9 lumens in 20 hours. Very compact size for in your pocket when you only have the one battery in there. And then, like I said, there are three power settings. Uh, it always defaults to the high setting. And then a quick push right after that will cycle it through the different settings. It does have a momentary switch as well, which I just demonstrated. Then if you screw the extension back on, that'll let you have two double A's, and that'll give you about 180 lumens at the high setting, 50 lumens at the medium setting, and 16 lumens at the low setting, 2 hours, 8 hours, and 45 hours. Or if you use just the single 14500 cell, that'll give you about 325 lumens, blindingly bright. You get about an hour's worth of runtime with that. 159 lumens at the medium setting with 4 hours of runtime and about 13 lumens at the low setting giving you about 50 hours. So you can see uh, it'll stand on the tail and also when it's got the crenellated bezel on there you can tip it up on the head and you can still see whether your light is on or off. Just cycling through the settings once more. I really like this flashlight. It is bright. Um, the holster is just nylon with a belt loop on it. You're probably going to want to get a better quality leather holster for your flashlight if you plan on carrying it on your belt. Here's a demonstration of the flashlight outside. Uh, the fireplace that I'll be shining the light on is about 25 feet away from the doorway where I am standing. That's high, that's medium, and that's low. And then I'll move the flashlight to the ground just so you can see the spread of the light. That's a high beam, medium, and low. So overall, uh, the camcorder is not really giving you a, a totally accurate indication of the brightness of this light. It is super bright. I'm telling you, it's an awesome light. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. I'll answer it if I can. Otherwise, thanks for watching, and have a great day.